Between the London suburbs of Walthamstow and Chingford, where I recently did a few days of exploration, there is a dog track. I had never experienced dog racing before, so I decided to check it out. Having no idea what to expect when I got inside, I was intrigued, and a little bit relieved, to find that the whole scene looked just like a miniature horse racing track with which, I admit, I am somewhat familiar. As the crowd filed in, I saw professional bookies, obvious regulars who looked like they might have some hot tips, folks who appeared to be somewhat less sure of themselves, and many who seemed to be more than just a little bit lost. With a few minutes to go before the first race, I got myself a beverage and a little inside information. Huh? What's your name? Where are you from? Stuart from London, England. And what are you doing here? Just, well, working. Bar. Bar work. How long have you been doing this? Two years. You like it? Yeah, it's alright. You learn the dogs from doing this? Yep. Yeah? Quite a lot, yeah. You make more money ten and bar, more money on the dogs? Bar. <laughs> really? <laughs> I'm just at the dogs. Really? Yeah, but it's fun. Yeah, that's it. Alright, thanks a lot. All right. As race time approaches, the dogs are paraded in front of the grandstand. Those of you who are familiar with horse racing will no doubt see the similarity in ceremony, but it is here that you can also see the differences in scale, casual ambiance, and relaxed composure of the racers themselves. Knowing absolutely nothing about any of the dogs, I implemented my tried and true method of betting on the dog whose number was the same as the race he was running. This being footage from the fifth race, that's my doggy. With the dogs loaded into the starting box, it's time for them to do what they are born to do, bred to do, and just plain love to do. Run really, really fast. And they're off. With the race successfully completed, the dogs free run to the other side of the track where they wag their tails, meet their handlers, and get their pats. I'm sure you all know what a dog lover I am, so you can imagine how glad I was to see that the dogs are so well treated and cared for. And of course, it is always a pleasure for me to see dogs who are happy and proud of what they do. I did it, I really did it. That's my dog. <laughs>